Johnny Pash here, welcome to my channel on this gorgeous beach here in Arachibi in Greece. Last day of my holiday, myself, my girlfriend, we've been on the beach literally all week. Something about being by the sea is so tranquil, gives you so much peace of mind and it actually gets the creative juices flowing. And I sat there on the sun lounger and I was jotting down some of my short-term goals to what I wanted to achieve towards the end of the year. And I actually came up with the success strategy. And it comes in four different points. So we've got our goal, we've got our time frame, we have our why, and number four is your affirmation. Okay, so step number one is your goal. You have to be clear on your goal, whatever it may be. It could be something to do with your home life, relationships. Do you want to have more money? Do you want to be more, more fitter towards the end of the year? Whatever it may be, you need to jot down that goal. You can either do it in your notepad or on your vision boards. You know I'm a true believer in vision boards. And you have to affirm and state that goal so you have to write. I am grateful and thankful now that I have whatever it may be. Uh, let me give you an example. Of, I need a flatter, more toned stomach before the end of the year, preferably a six fat, that'd be amazing. So I jotted down on my goal list, I am grateful and thankful now that I have a flatter a stomach towards the end of the year. So state that goal, make it clear, Put it down in your notepad or your vision board right now. Now, step number two is time. So you've got your goal. You now have underneath time. You've got to set a date on this, guys. You can't ask for more money next year in 2019. God knows when that will happen. You have to stay a time. Now, I stay to the time that I want a flatter, more toned stomach by December 15, 2018. So I rewrote on my notepad, on my vision board, I am grateful and thankful now that I have a, a fitter, toner stomach by December the 15th. Jot that time down, the timestamp is very important. And look guys, time's very important because you can accomplish that goal, whatever it may be, and then just cross it out and set a new goal with a different time. Step three, is why so you have to list as many reasons as you can to why you want to accomplish that goal and have that goal in your life so to give you an example flatter more toned athletic stomach why because it gives me more confidence it makes me feel a little bit more comfortable taking my top off in the middle of Greece even though it doesn't look too bad I can look in the mirror every morning and, and look at my stomach and say, yeah, I feel good, I feel fit, I feel well, I, I feel great, and look at me in the body, I'm doing something good for my body, I feel great right now. So list as many reasons to why you want to achieve that goal in the time frame that you need. And number four is your affirmation. This is where all the magic happens. We have to write out an affirmation to that particular goal. And we have to read it back every single morning just after you meditate. I'm gonna do a separate video for you guys about 12 affirmations, how to write out your perfect affirmation and a meditation exercise that you could do every morning to just expand and relay the knowledge and the magical power of your affirmations. So I wrote down I am committed and confident that I will achieve a flatter, healthier, toned stomach by December the 15th. And then under that affirmation, how? How am I gonna do that? I'm gonna go to the gym twice a day. I'm gonna eat the right foods, no sugars, no, no fatty foods. I'm gonna limit my alcohol intake play football twice a week, whatever it may be. So whatever your goal is, and you're trying to figure out how I can achieve that goal, have the how in the affirmation. So I am committed and confident 
to doing X, Y, Z, and this is how I'm going to do it. And repeat that over and over and over. And keep saying those affirmations every single morning after your meditation techniques. So guys, that is the success strategy, okay? Number one, be clear, state that goal. Number two, give yourself a realistic time frame, whatever it may be, to how you can accomplish this with your busy schedule, your busy work life, whatever it may be. Number three is your why. It has to be an important goal for you. It has to change your life in some way. So how is that gonna be important to you? Why is that gonna be important to you right now? And number four is your affirmation. Jot down a positive affirmation on a piece of paper in a notepad or in your vision board and repeat it over and over and over every single morning. I'm gonna do a separate video on affirmations, how you can write your affirmations out properly, how you keep it in a piece of paper in your back pocket. You're looking at it every morning after the meditation technique that I'm gonna give back to you in the next video. Guys, get subscribing, more videos coming your way. Thank you for checking out johnnypash.com. And look, feel free to drop me an email with any information you'll need. All of the information is in the description below. Have a wonderful day.